Hey everybody! Okay, so Winter Storm Elliot is here and it's cold outside. <laughs> I know many of you are experiencing this storm too and we're lucky we still have power and we're in good shape inside. We have a wood stove and when the rain transitioned to ice last night and then snow, we had this amazing shelter called our house. And what I'm seeing right here is really interesting. All these birds that were out last night had to deal with that flash freeze. And so when I filled up the feeders this morning, they came in, of course, and I noticed that many couldn't fly very well and they have ice all over their backs and many of them have them on their face. And some are much better than others. It would clearly depend on where they were roosted for the night. And so it's now about uh, 10 or so a.m. And the temps are going to get colder today due to the winds. And so I don't know about that ice on them, but they're working slowly to get it off. And it seems that they feed and then they work on getting into some shelter and then work on the ice and then tuck their heads back in, go get food. <laughs> go get shelter, do it over again. And our bird bath still it has a little bit of water thanks to our heater that we have in there. I'm showing you this scene right here in particular though because this is out our south door. You can see the bird tape that we have on the windows. And the plants have tipped over in here, which we've talked about on numerous videos. And there are birds all over in this area because it is providing the shelter they need from this bitter cold. There are birds sitting on the stalks, under the stalks, on the east side of the stalks. The wind currently is out of the southwest on the north side of that garage which you're not gonna be able to tell with my phone camera, but there is a cut plant stalk that's laying on its side, so very sturdy. There's 15 to 20 birds of mixed species on that stalk. And throughout here, there's another area past that table where there's about 10 or so house finches hanging out together. Some of them are iced pretty significantly and some are not. So we are just noting, due to the number of birds we're seeing hunkered down here, that this is some pretty gosh darn good habitat, y'all. These birds should be able to find shelter on all of our properties. If you're not seeing that, consider adding more and more native plants and not cutting them down for the winter. This is obviously crucial for them today. I mean, these are life or death temperatures out there. And so we are safe and warm inside. And since the world is the house for all of these birds, all of these mammals, they deserve to also be safe and warm. And we owe them that since we have a fairly significant footprint on this planet. So let's share some space, y'all. And then you can look out your windows and be toasty and go, okay, they're all right. They're surviving. Okay, we hope you're staying warm and well too. And thank you so very much for what you're doing at your place. It really is so critical.